Cody Ballas reported you from yeah. our home during the COVID epidemic. I hope you're getting along well. And uh, we're here to show you about a tripod today and the bald head that I had gotten. Uh, you have to notice my hair is kind of long. It's kind of my protest against the COVID epidemic. But it's getting so long now, it's about time to get it cut. Heck with the nonsense. <laughs> Too many people are protesting as it is these days, and probably for good reason in some instances, but I think they're overdoing it. But anyway, that's my own opinion. I had just gotten this a while back and hadn't even opened it yet, so I could open it here with you today. Cut these, this tape on this fragile handle with care. Pro 700DX leg. It's got legs, of course. It's a tripod. Shouldn't it have legs? I hadn't used a tripod when I first started out doing photography all that much, and it made it kind of hard because I had to use higher ISOs some of the time, and especially in dark light situations. Most cameras I had didn't work very well uh, in dark light situations either. The camera I'm using to uh, film this with right now is a D7500 uh, Nikons. I had a uh, I had a uh, D3200 before that, and um, here's the uh, instructions or destructions with it, more like instructions. Wow, this thing is nice and heavy. The heavier the tripod, somewhat the better. You want to have a medium between how heavy the tripod is and how much you have to carry carry it. So if you're going on a mountainous hike or a hike, you know, back a few miles into the woods or so, or even farther for some people, um, it, it makes it uh, you know easier to carry if it's somewhat lighter. But the heavier tripods, when the wind blows and things like that, they're more sturdy. They're more sturdy just in general, because walking on certain kinds of ground could even shake a tripod, I guess. But they are more sturdy sometimes than trying to hand hold stuff, especially in low light, which a lot of us photographers that do landscape photography and wildlife photography and things like that are out early in the morning as the sun is coming up or soon thereafter during the uh, golden hour, some people call it, or the magic hour, I don't know, there's a couple different names for it. Okay, this is a, this here is, loosens this up, and then, yeah, and you can raise, raise this when you need higher things. I think this goes up to like seven feet. I guess, uh, look in here real quick, if we got a, uh, Allen wrench screw. There's Allen screws on these legs. They actually looks like come off and are possibly replaceable if it would happen to get broken or sometimes they may need to be tightened up. This this thing here pops out this way and it allows you to put your legs farther out so you can get it lower to the ground. Or if you're on a hillside, you can put this into the hill and these two down, legs down towards the uh, towards the ground or the lower part of the uh, the slope. This is a ProMaster. It's a ball head type. Screw this on here. get a plate for here. Plate? I got it a couple weeks after I started recording this video. This goes right on here and screws on.
Okay, again, close up. Here's the knob that turns to allow it to spin 360 degrees. You can tighten this one down some, and then this one will loosen it up again, and we tighten, can tighten it down. Here you have your lock that ups and downs the legs and you can lock it into place, you know, wherever you want it. Say so you want it there, you lock it. This one does the bottom leg. It's only got uh, two sections that move up and down. Has foam padding on it that uh, Makes it easier to grab, I guess, and you can have get a fairly good grip on it, and also protects the metal, I guess, some from scratching and things of that nature. Okay, this is the other type of uh, tripod head I have, which is more of a video type. It moves more easily side to side with this arm. Something else this tripod came with, a silk bag, nice carrying handle, put that baby in there, we work this thing, do like so. Oh, it even's got room enough for the ball head right there. Yep, she's a good one. Nice little bag, carrying bag. Carry it up in those mountains and on those hillsides and take pictures of some sheep or whatever. All right, let's go. Dale. Be safe, stay well during the COVID epidemic and hope this thing ends really soon. Um, we'll be back with you next time and we'll show you more on better techniques of using a tripod. We'll maybe we'll go out in the field and take us some pictures. You have a wonderful weekend and nice day.